Carl. Wilbur, come back, please. If you don't, you'll get caught like always. Shift the blame to me. We'll fight, not talk for a week. Think you're tired of not talking. You'll come up with another crazy plan, and I'll get blamed again. Relax, Carl. Operation Tut is complete. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You're skipping carefree down the road to inevitable doom. Carl, I barely touched anything. I'm sure that whatever minor alteration may have occurred will go completely unnoticed. Unnoticed? Gee, you think they'll notice this? Chariot of the gods? I know this looks bad, but let's examine the evidence. That could be any kid riding a time machine. See? My hair is completely different. Yeah, Wilbur. There you are, Wilbur. 
I'm leaving on a business trip for a few days. Don't touch the time for sure. I want you to alter existence as we know it, okay? Absolutely. Wait a minute. Great dad. Goodbye, See you in a few days. What did he say about the time machine? He said, give him a crib of God now, we're gonna have to dig it. Which means, have fun with the time machine. Just a little code talk that my dad and I have. Yeah, we're tight. See? I just need one more person to finish my collection. Someone who's suave, debonair, and has rock star good looks. To the time machine! Oh, there you are. Have you taken out the garbage yet? No, but I'm dying to do it. Honest. Because I think someone just changed the garage code. What? But I needed to get in there. This oh, is terrible. I know you're disappointed. Taking out the garbage is quite a thrill. Mission accomplished.